All right, everybody, welcome to class. My name is Teacher Chad, um, and this hour we are going to be practicing our speaking while uh, um, talking about stress, okay? What it is, how we deal with it, uh, all those sorts of things. Um, and it looks like I have to uh, go back out. Um, Hangouts is freezing up on me again. Um, so uh, who, who do I have in class right now? Who's in? Hello, uh, who do I have in class right now? I'm Daniela. Uh, Daniela, welcome. Uh, Daniela, I need to leave uh, Hangouts real quick and then come back in because it's freezing on me, okay? So I'll be right back, all right? Okay. All righty. I have to ask, uh, uh, I have to... There we go. Okay, now it's working fine. Uh, every once in a while, whenever I I join uh, I join a, a hangout, um, it goes really slow and it doesn't work well for me. So I have to leave and then come back in. Anyway, welcome back to class, Daniela. Good to have you here. Mm, thank you. All right. How about uh, Giovanni? How are you? I'm here. Hey there. How you doing? I'm here. Can you hear me? Can can you see me? Yes, I can. I can hear you and see yeah. you just fine. Hi, my favorite teacher. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm doing great, man. Welcome, welcome back to class. Thank you so much. Looking forward to having your class. Yes, it should be a fun one. Uh, let's see yeah. here. All right, you guys. Um, okay, uh, old cool. Odku, how are you? Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing great. Doing great. Good to have you here. How is your work? Uh, work is going very well. It's going very well. Yeah, okay. I'm uh, enjoying the day so far. All right. Okay, you guys. Um, it may just be us three. Oh, we're getting more slowly as uh, time goes on. Let's see here. Uh, John? Hi teacher, how are you? I'm doing good. <laughs> how's how's the weather today in Colombia? All all fine. Awesome. Very good. Okay. <laughs> all right, you guys. So uh, this hour we are going to be talking about stress. Okay, uh, how we deal with it, what it is, things like that. And um, I have. Uh, I've got, let's see here, I think it's about five or six different uh, categories. So recognizing stress, uh, helping others, okay, helping others with stress, healthy stress, uh, personal, okay, so personal stress, stressful situations, uh, controlling stress, uh, living stress-free, and I think that's it. Okay, so what I want to do is uh, I'm going to go through and we're going to uh, uh, pick a question from uh, from each of these categories as we uh, as we go through uh, uh, through the class. Okay, now if you don't like the question, that's okay. You can you can say, teacher, I don't like the question. Give me another one. I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to hurt my feelings. Okay, <laughs> so uh, it's fine to say you don't like the question. So it's all right. Okay, uh, let's see, we have some other newcomers in. Uh, Pradeep, how are you? Hi, teacher, I am fine, thank you. How about awesome. you? I'm doing great. Welcome to class, good to see you. Thank you, sir. And Action made it in as well. How you doing, Action? Uh, I'm doing well, Chad, I'm in your class. Awesome. So, it's good nice to have you that back. your class okay, is not you fully reserved. 
yeah, I've got uh, I've got some space uh, space left uh, a little bit of space left open today. Uh, um, yeah, very good. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and uh, and get uh, get started, you guys. Uh, we're going to start off with Pradi over on the uh, right hand side, and <clears throat> we're going to uh, look at uh, recognizing stress first. Okay, so Pradi, um, first two yeah. questions are for you. What is stress and what causes stress? Uh, actually, uh, stress is always uh, somebody is getting, you know, hard work or some, you know, some angry, uh, angry time and, you know, uh, some, <clears throat> sometimes they are too much mad time. So, the people are getting stress. Stress always, yeah, stress. So, they, they, cannot, they cannot do anything with the stress because of, uh, you know, uh, it's, it's mentally and hard hard work when when they are doing some hard work so and if they if they don't have any any relax relaxation so they are always getting stress all right and uh, what would be another word that you could use for stress if you were to think of another word for stress Pradeep, what word could you use in english uh, you can use stress is uh, uh, tension. Okay, good. Yeah, tension. Yeah. Okay, the the word that I was thinking of as well was pressure. So tension, uh, tension uh, or pressure. Either of those would be uh, really good ways of describing uh, stress. Now, stress is what we feel in our in our body, and and you know, kind of makes us uh, uptight and angry at times, right? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Thank you, Pradeep. Let's go to Odku, and Odku, we're going to go to our next section here, helping others. Okay, and Odku, have you ever helped someone who was feeling stressful? All right, and if, uh, if you have, what did you do? If you have not, uh, what would you do to help someone out if they were stressful? Have you have you ever uh, helped someone that was feeling stressful, Odku? Yes. Okay. Uh, what, what I, did you do? I helped uh, uh, you, you little boy. Uh, it was a, a little boy that was feeling stressed. No, uh, she's. Uh, uh, he is um, can't speak uh, and uh, can't walk and this is I don't know what is what he uh, have. Uh, okay, no. did the did the boy have an have an illness? Illness, yes. Uh, okay. Can't uh, can't talk and uh, can't walk, walk. Okay. And and so what uh, what did you do to help the boy with uh, with the stress that he was feeling? Mm. Stress. I don't know. Okay, uh, all right. That that's fine. That's fine. No, no worries. No worries. You you described a, a person that uh, could have a stressful day because of some limitations. Okay. Uh, let's go to Lily. Lily, welcome to class. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. How about you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. All right. We're talking about stress this hour, and I have some different sections here okay. on uh, my list. Uh, our next section here is healthy stress. Okay. okay. Now, Lily, yeah. do you think stress is ever good, useful, or necessary? Why or why not? Stress is ever good? What does yeah. that mean? Um, stress. Do you think uh, stress is ever, uh, um, is ever useful or, or necessary in life? Okay, uh, uh, stress uh, can be uh, described as maybe pressure, 
okay um uh maybe pressure at work yeah. pressure at school yeah. okay um where you where you have this tension that you're fighting against okay now do you ever think stress is good or necessary okay um, why or why not uh, for me i don't think that stress is good <laughs> okay <laughs> because i am uh, a person who has this problem i'm uh, stressed how to say that i am stressed Stressed out. You can say, I am stressed out all the time. It, it, yes, I can say it's all the time, but it is like. Uh, okay, you can say a lot. Yeah, a lot. Yes. And I don't think that it's good because in everything that. Uh, if I am uh, stressed, uh, if I am on, on stress or in stress. Uh, if I am unstressed, un, okay. un unstressed. Yeah. If I am unstressed, I'm like, I I can't. Um, I'm very. Uh, I don't know how to explain. It. It's like, I can't concentrate with something, and I can't. I I always uh, in uh, how to say alert. I don't know how. <laughs> it's like. A, a little, uh, uh, maybe a little nose ca can make me. Uh, I don't know how to explain. Um. Okay. Well, it, but your your opinion uh, or your feeling is that stress is never never good because mm -hmm. you are a person that feels stress a lot, yeah. and uh, it it uh, it's not a comfortable feeling. No. Is that is that yeah. about right? Yes. Okay. All right. No problem. Thank you. Uh, let's go to John. Hi. Hi, John. Um, okay, so our next section is personal. Um, all right, John, have you felt stress recently? Okay, uh, did it last for a long time or a short time? Okay. Uh, I have feel stressed recently. Yes, because I need to learn English rapidly, uh, fast because I need to finish my studies and the, the speak English is very important for me for me okay job. speaking speaking English okay we would use the gerund form speaking English is very important for me yes uh, so speaking English is very important for me and uh, and have stress for for feeling last last time all the time, I okay. I am uh, thinking in this uh, in, in speak English. In, okay. In, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Good. Yeah. So when we are talking about um, uh, the ability to do something, we would use the gerund form. So uh, speaking English um, is very important to me to be able to finish my studies. Okay, yeah, teacher, it's me first reason for studying English in Berlin. Okay, and uh, and so that that causes a little bit of stress in your life because learning a language is frustrating, right? It is super frustrating. Okay, so all right. Okay, good. Thank you, John. Uh, Ismail, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, Chet. How are you? I'm doing great. Welcome to class. Um, our next uh, next uh, um, topic here is stressful situations. All right. So, Ismail, um, are there stressful? Uh, are there situations that you find stressful? Okay. Or what situations do you find stressful? Uh, yes, Chad. Uh, it depends on the uh, correct. Uh, of the man, I think, because I have an A type character, and that's why I am feeling uh, uh, generally uh, on stress, especially in uh, working life. But there are uh, some uh, work friends around me in my workplace. 
they don't feel uh, too much stress in the same condition. Okay, so also, it depends. Uh, it depends on the on the the character, right? If they're yes, able to deal with stress on, or not. Yes, I think so. And what situation uh, is stressing me uh, when I uh, have very much work to do? I feel. Uh, under stress, I try to uh, end all of work in a short time. If okay. I end my work, I couldn't feel relaxed. I can't sleep uh, light. Okay. All right. So uh, some some people get uh, stressed out with work, uh, others don't. Uh, and uh, there are situations when you uh, when you do, and, and work is the main cause. All right. Very good. Thank you, Smile. Let's go to Giovanni. I'm here. All right, Giovanni. Controlling stress. All right. So, Giovanni, how do you relieve stress? Okay, this is a, a this is an interesting question. I think that um, talking about my personal experience, I can say that stress for me is related to to the words to the word mother-in-law. Yeah. You know? <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> yes, but I, because it's pretty difficult to deal with with her. But I think that the best way to relieve from uh, from stress is to is to run. Okay. But, but I have a a personal way to alleviate my my stress, and uh, I don't want to be rude, but is to have sex. <laughs> and you know what? That's what have the the uh, and honest to goodness, it's exactly what I was yeah. thinking. Yes. Two main it, two main ways of relieving stress: exercise yeah. and sex. And, and sex, <laughs> right? Yeah. The two main yes. ways. Two main yeah. ways. Okay. <laughs> yes, this is my personal recipe in order to alleviate uh, from stress. There you go. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Very good. Thank you. Uh, go let's uh, let's see. Let's go to Daniela. Yes. All right, Daniela. Uh, living stress-free. This is our uh, our next one here, Daniela. Um, how can you live a stress-free life? What uh, what type of things would uh, would you need to do or change to be able to live a stress-free life, Daniela? Um, uh, uh, for me, uh, the best things uh, or is uh, um, having a. Uh, uh, a very good partner uh, because uh, uh, I use uh, I speak a lot. I talk with the, him a lot. So uh, sometimes when I'm on stress, uh, I prefer uh, talk with him mm -hmm. uh, to to have a relaxing time uh, because uh, he is uh, usually a very smiler pe person. Is a very optimist. So he um, uh, he's very optimistic, or yeah. he is an optimist. See, yes, he is very optimistic person. So he makes me he makes me uh, more uh, happy. Okay, he makes me happier. He makes me happier. Yes. Okay, very good. Awesome. Okay, so having having a good partner, having someone to uh, share. Um, Share your your life with right, and be able to talk to and uh, and and uh, um, and kind of bounce your ideas off and things like that. Yeah, I think that's a that's a great uh, great idea. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Uh, let's go to action, and let's see. Yeah. Am I down to the bottom? Okay, so back up to the top here. All right. So recognizing stress, action. Um, how do you recognize stress in your life? Okay, so how do you recognize when you are stressed out? So when I'm tired, uh, 
when I can't enjoy my life, my days, uh, I know that I'm in distress. So when I have a uh, sleep problem, I think that uh, I'm in stress. Okay, so uh, so uh, those those are the ways that you recognize when you're when you're stressed. Okay, all right, yeah. awesome. Thank you, thank you. Uh, let's go to Pradeep. Um, Pradeep, okay, so helping others is our next one here. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Pradeep, have you yeah. ever helped? Uh, have you ever helped someone that you uh, that you didn't know? Okay, and they they may have been in a uh, stressful situation. Uh, what uh, what did you do for them? No, actually, I I, I never had uh, like this experience. I mean, uh, for the help someone, uh, I doesn't had like this experience. Okay. All right. No problem. Uh, let's uh, let's go down to our next uh, next one here then. Um, uh, healthy stress. Do do you play games or sports that are sometimes stressful? Pradeep. I think it's it's for me. Uh, yeah, that's 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 for you. Since you since you haven't had any situations where you've helped someone, I I, I just switched to another question for you, which is fine. So, uh, Pradeep, do you uh, do you play games or sports that are sometimes stressful? Maybe uh, maybe soccer, uh, badminton, um, cricket. Sometimes uh, sports can be uh, stressful. Do you play those types of games? Uh, yeah, really no, really no. If if I haven't stressful, I I never go to sports. You know. I don't want uh, with the stress because sometimes you know I will get uh, more trouble with the stress. Okay. If I'm going to the sports, so okay. it's you know it's uh, it's it's not necessary for me. I never go. <laughs> okay. All right. No worries. No worries. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go to uh, Odku. Okay. All right, Odku. Um. Okay, uh, Otku, how often do you think you feel too much stress? Mm, I am angry. Uh, not anger, not anger, but, you know, stress, where you feel the pressure. I am feel this. Okay, how, I feel how often? Does that ha happen a lot, or not very much, or uh, um, sometimes? Odku? Uh, <laughs> Odku, do you uh, do you understand this question here? No. Okay, um, uh, stress. Okay, stress is uh, feeling pressure. Okay, feeling like you have maybe a lot to do, not enough time to do it. Okay, and it can sometimes uh, um, make you angry. Sometimes. Okay, other times it it kind of makes people want to uh, zone out, maybe make you tired. Okay, now. Do uh, do you feel stress in your life, Odku? Do you feel stress? Uh, stress. Haku, do you have a, a mother-in-law? <laughs> <laughs> Yes, wow. a mother-in-law. A mother-in-law would definitely cause stress. Okay, uh, uh, Odku, what what I would suggest is to uh, to look up the word, uh, look up the word stress, okay, and and take a look at what the meaning is because I don't believe you uh, you understand exactly what the word stress is. Okay, so look up the word stress in a dictionary, and I'll come back around to you. Okay. Okay. All right, thank you. Um, okay, let's go to uh, Lily. Um, let's let's do this question for you. 
Okay. Uh, so Lily, um, how uh, how often do you think you feel stress? A lot, uh, a little? Uh, the last time it's uh, getting down, but before I was almost every time a lot. Okay, so yeah. instead of the last time, we would say lately. Late, lately, yes. Lately, lately. it has um, it uh, it has not been as much. Mm -hmm. It has not been as much. I have I have a uh, mother in law. Great. <laughs> 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 I have mother in law, but she's not stressful. It's the opposite. Opposite. Lucky you. I, Yes, I am lucky. I know. <laughs> it is recorded. It is recorded. Be careful. <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. All uh, right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So lately, it's been less, but uh, before you did have a a lot of stress. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Thank you. Let's go to Juan. How you doing, Juan? I uh, good. And you? I'm doing great. Uh, all right, so uh, our next section here is stressful situations. Um, Juan, do you feel tense when you uh, meet someone for the first time? Uh, yes. Okay, and bit, why um, do you feel stressed? <clears throat> okay. Uh, well, uh, because uh, I don't know um, if... Uh, the intentions of the other person or uh, well it depends on the situation but for example if it is a, a girl I, I really like or would like to, to know better um, will be stressed because I, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be of her of her preference or or choice or um, interest okay all right yeah so you don't know uh, you don't know what what's going to happen Okay, you don't know if she's going to like you or something like that. So that can be uh, a bit stressful. Yeah, and also in um, in other contexts, uh, uh, you you don't know if uh, <clears throat> if there's going to be um, empathy. You, you don't know how to break the ice. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Very good. It it may be a little awkward. All right. Let's see. Let's go to John. Okay, John, contr controlling stress. Um, all right, so, um, uh, John, uh, what stresses you out? What is the biggest thing that stresses you out? Uh, does he have the, the person that are like like you? Or when I, I am working, if I don't can to be the job, uh, fine. Uh, um, what do you mean? I I don't can find the job or be the job I fine. Don't. What do you mean? I don't can find the job. Yeah. You you can't finish. No. Uh, to I am building roads, and sometimes I don't can to make that that they they functioning. They function. Function. Okay. No okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, so let's see here. Let me see if I can uh, understand uh, your your job right now. You uh, the job that you do is you build roads. Is that right? Okay, teacher. Yeah. Okay. So sometimes uh, with with work you can't get things to function correctly when you are building the road. In, in, in this moment, in, yeah, they, they not function is, is for me, uh, uh, stress, stress, you out. Okay, all right, yeah, okay, so, uh, so work is your, your biggest uh, stress, all right. Okay, very good, thank you, John. Uh, let's go to Ismael. And Ismael, uh, next section here. Uh, living stress free. Okay. Um, let's see here. Okay. Um, when stressful, do you like to listen to a certain kind of music? Okay. Do you have a certain type of music that uh, helps um, 
calm you down and helps uh, um, re relax you. Uh, yes, chat. I sometimes try to listen my uh, lovely uh, music when I under stress, but I usually uh, make sport. I try to walk in the okay. park. I usually do uh, do sports. Yes. Okay, I usually do sports or something like that. We would say do. Okay. Okay. And so, uh, what you said that you uh, walk in the park. What else do you do? And uh, if uh, my uh, sleep uh, disorders, I eat some wine before sleeping. It calms uh, me. Uh, good, drink. You drink some wine. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Instead of eat, uh, it would be drink. Drink some wine. Yes. I drink some wine. Uh, yeah, it helps uh, to sleep well. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. Thank you very much. All right. Let's go to Giovanni. And I believe that's it. So back up to the top here. So recognizing stress. Um, okay. So um, Giovanni, have you yes. been under stress recently? Yes. Uh, okay. Mother in law, besides mother in law, uh, <laughs> okay. Um, I have a problem with my work because just yesterday I went on strike because oh, my no. com yes, because my company uh, announced uh, many too many mis dismissal because of awful economic economical crisis and uh, yeah. yes, yes, I'm. Uh, I actually I'm I'm under stress and uh, I try to to cope with with it by studying English and <laughs> because English makes me feel happy. Okay. And <laughs> and uh, try to smile. I think that think positive is the is a good way to. Uh, uh, to cope with with stress, and uh, I think that the first signal uh, to recognize stress in my life is, uh, is that I'm I have some difficulties on sleeping and with uh, with sleeping uh, yes with sleeping. with sleeping yes with sleeping and uh, okay uh, nervosism too much nervosism. And uh, what else? Okay, this is my my personal signals. And wow. I try, yes, I try to, but I think that there is a a positive stress because if you are um, on about to have an exam, for example, I think mm -hmm. that is it's a, it's good to be uh, under stress because of the exam. And because it allows you to to um, to have uh, your exam, to deliver your exam uh, uh, by doing your very best. I think uh, I think so. Okay. All right. Yeah. I I uh, I I would agree with that. Yeah. There are there are forms of good stress at times yeah. to be that pressure to get something done. Well, I hope everything works out with uh, with your company, and they uh, they uh, realize their folly, and uh, you're able to get yeah. back to work. Yes, I hope so. <laughs> All right, very good. Okay. Thank you. Let's go to Daniela. Mm -hmm. All right, Daniela. Let's see. Our next one here is helping others. Okay. Um. Uh, let's see. So what uh, of a good counselor? So what uh, what are characteristics of a good counselor? So someone that would help uh, help someone else uh, get through some stressful situations. Okay, so a counselor being someone that you can talk to maybe when there's a death in your family or uh, you know when you've had a you know some sort of situation like that. What would be some good characteristics of of a uh, counselor? What do you think, Daniela? Uh, in my opinion. Uh, the best way uh, is um, uh, take on control uh, somebody else um, 
maybe uh, giving a, a good advice uh, or uh, um, sometimes uh, inviting uh, him uh, uh, to, go, to go out to, uh, to drink something or to eat something uh, to discuss uh, about problems uh, okay. or something like that. Okay, and uh, and uh, if this person's a, a good counselor, um, um, uh, yeah, they would they would discuss things with them. And what uh, um, they they what else? What what? How else could you describe uh, someone that is a good counselor? Okay, uh, someone uh, that another person can talk to. Uh, the first thing uh, uh, is uh, um, uh, there is a person who uh, listen listen. Uh, a lot and very well. Okay, and that because, would be listens, uh, listens with an uh, S there at the end. Listens, yes, because uh, um, first to give advice uh, is uh, better uh, to to, li to listening uh, uh, about problems, and after um, um, you can give uh, a good uh, a good uh, suggestions. Okay. All right, so someone that has uh, that is a good listener, uh, but also can give uh, good suggestions. Okay, all right, sounds good. Thank you. Uh, let's go to action. All right, yeah. action. Let's see here. Um. Okay. Uh, when can stress be a good thing? Okay, if you're playing sports and uh, your team is losing, does it give you extra energy? Yeah. Okay, so. Sometimes I think it depends. For example, I had a manager in my previous job. He said that uh, uh, my managing still is is using st st stress and and make uh, make the circumstances more stressful. So, but but as a person, uh, for example, stress, uh, I I don't. I don't like stress, and I don't do my best in the stressful positions. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. All right. Is there is there anybody in class that works well under stress? Yes. Is there anybody in class? Personally, personally, I I, I love stress. Okay, because mm -hmm. I'm able to manage it well. Um, I I work out hard. Okay, when I say hard, um, I work out really, really, really hard about, you know, four, four times a week, and that's about eight hours total um, of really intense workout, and so that's how I get out my stress, and so when there's problems with the job or, um, you know, other, other issues like that, and though, I mean, this job is not, is not extremely stressful, um, but yeah, when internet goes out, I'm like, man, if I don't if I don't teach an hour, I don't get paid for the hour, you know, things like that. There's all, all there's a, everyone has certain types of stress, um, but um, before, okay, I had I had a lot of stress in in uh, in my life working in the United States, and uh, that amount of stress has now gone down, but I still uh, I still am able to maintain it well. But yeah, for me, working under stress. Uh, I'm able to get a lot more done. I'm able to focus, um, and then afterwards I go, "Whew! All right, that was great. Uh, on to the next thing." Okay. So, is uh, is is there anybody else that works well under stress? Yes, sir. Okay, uh, Ismail, go ahead, and then uh, Giovanni. The level uh, of stress is uh, very important in this subject, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, because an acceptable amount of stress is good okay. to work well, but uh, the high level of stress, I think that is uh, very destructive and it, uh, it is hindering people uh, to work well. It depends on the amount of stress, I think, Chad. Yeah, and the, I guess the type of stress, if you have, I've never had a boss where it's like, you have to do this, and they were, I mean, just like really like hovering over me or anything like that. It was my own stress that I was putting on myself to get things done. Okay. How about uh, you, Giovanni? What's, yes, uh, yes uh -huh. I, I was, I was uh, um, thinking about my work, about my job. Yes, I'm one of, the, of those people 
who uh, deliver the very best uh, under stress at work, mm -hmm. and and it's 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 it's, it's, uh, it's strange because <laughs> because I'm a, a really uh, I'm a real um, um, reserved laid, uh, laid a back. It would be a laid back person. I'm a real laid back person. Yes, yes, yes. I'm laid back, and but I I found out or recently found out that uh, I'm re I'm very good at at working under stress, mm -hmm. and, uh, and because uh, uh, like uh, like you said, uh, it allows me to to focus my my control my control. Okay, make sure you say fo focus. Fo focus. You, my, yeah, if you yes. say fa. Okay, you're now entering into the cuss word, <laughs> cuss word world. Okay, okay. And so you don't, um, yeah, fo. Make sure whenever you have an F, okay, and you don't mean to say fa, okay, you want to say <laughs> fo, focus. Fo, okay? focus, focus. There you go, okay. Focus, uh, okay, focus my concentration on what, what, uh, what I'm doing. And, uh, yes. Okay. This is, this is my personal experience. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm in the same boat. I'm in the same boat as you. Okay, great, great. All right, let's uh, let's go back up to the top here to Pradeep. All right, here. Hi. Hey there. Okay, next one here. Um, a personal section. Um, okay, Pradeep, do you yes. feel too busy sometimes? And why? And what do you do to uh, uh, to kind of make yourself less busy? Yeah, actually, when it's busy, coming I mean, always uh, I'm not thinking about it's too busy because if I'm thinking about it's too busy, so it's very difficult for me. I have I I cannot do anything. You know, that time I will get more busy. So if I I, I don't have feel about busy. So if I am uh, focused always uh, for the work, so I can able to do it. Okay, so when you're too busy, um, you feel like there's uh, there's too much and you can't get you can't get anything done. Is that what you're saying? If there's too much, if you're too busy, like ah, I can't think, I can't control it. Okay, and then you uh, you go you uh, you don't get anything done. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, if too busy, yes, I think I can get good uh, advantage. I mean, I can get good benefits. Uh, example, if a restaurant, if I, if I am a restaurant manager, mm -hmm. for example, uh, I was I was working in KFC. Okay, uh, so much uh, busy in KFC. Uh, you know that the Ramadan time. Do you know Ramadan, right? In Muslim holiday, Ramadan time. So my manager was getting uh, that time uh, very busy and very straight and very angry that time. But he got also good benefit okay. uh, by busy time because he got good average to our restaurant and he got also award from the company. What was yeah. oh you got an award? Is that what you said? You got an award? Award award. What's the what's the last word you're saying there? Because it sounds like a ward, like a yeah. uh, award or reward for okay, Re okay, reward, reward, oh, reward. Gotcha. See? All right, all right. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go to Lily. All right, here, Lily. Let's see here. Stressful situations. Okay, Lily. Um, do you get nervous if you have to make a speech? Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you guys do you guys know the uh, the uh, um, there's the it's not really a saying, but it's like um, uh, the top two things people are most afraid of. Okay, number one is speaking in front of a uh, of a group, and yeah. number two is dying. <laughs> so, so, if number one is speaking in front of a group and number two is dying, <laughs> how did the joke go? It's like. Um, if someone, uh, someone would, if at a funeral, someone would would rather be dead than speak at a funeral, than you know give the uh, eulogy. Anyway, mm -hmm. uh, 
it's uh, it's uh, very interesting. So, so tell us about uh, you getting nervous or uh, having a you know this fear or stressing out about speaking in front of other people, Lily. Oh, it's like it's just the way that all of those people watching on, on uh, at you and. <laughs> It's uh, like, watching, it's watching you watching instead of watching you. at you, just watching you. Watching you, it's very stressful, and uh, also, I, I don't know if you make make sure that your uh, your speech is uh, is not <laughs> uh, not so ridiculous speech or something like this because. That not help for stress. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> now, um, is there is there anybody in class that does not get afraid when when uh, being in front of people? Oh. Uh, Am I the only one? Okay. So John John doesn't get scared. Uh, Daniela doesn't get scared. Um, I, I've played I've played music. Um, in fr the largest group that I played in front of was 12,000 people. And so I had 12,000 people out in front of me. And uh, yeah, I was a little wow. nervous at first. But, uh, um, but when I start playing, it all goes away and everything's good. Right? So yeah, I, uh, I, at first, when I first started uh, playing or performing in front of people, I did get nervous. I was like, oh, what are they going to think? All this stuff. And then uh, afterwards, it's like, ah. If I mess up, okay, not a very big deal. <laughs> sure. I was right. if, if it's uh, if it, those people, I know those people. Maybe I'm not stressed because when I was in a high school, yes, because when I was in a high school, uh, mm -hmm. I, I liked to sing, and we were, we had uh, uh, a party for for the school, uh -huh. and I was singing in front of a lot of uh, a lot of uh, students, but cool. I know who they are, so I was not stressed. Ah, okay. Yes. So I it's the, it's the being in front of other people that's a little freaky. Yes, freak. being out. Uh, yes, that sure. is very. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He smiled. Do you feel same when you sing around uh, two thousand people? Do uh, I feel? Do I feel scared? Is okay, maybe, but. No, I don't feel scared. <laughs> if you sing, do you feel the same feeling? Um, singing, singing, and speaking. Um, I guess the most most people that I've spoken to um, is probably six, six or seven hundred people where I've uh, actually been speaking in in front of them. Um, where me and my friend were the were a host, and we were you know dealing with this with this large group. Um, but yeah, I didn't um, singing. Yeah, okay. So singing and speaking that way would be different. This other way, when I was the host, I was with a, with a friend. We didn't have too many things rehearsed. We just kind of thought thought up things off the top of our head. Um, singing, I practice it so much. It's like getting up and kind of it's very robotic. Okay, I, I, you practice this whole this whole thing, and you're able to uh, you're able to uh, perform that. But if you let your nerves get to you, and you get up there and you go, yes, right, okay, yes. And, it, and it comes out terribly, then uh, then you lose. All right. So uh, yeah, it's a, it's a little different. Okay, let's go to John. Or sorry, Juan. Juan's up first, then John. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, controlling stress. Okay. So, um, uh, John or Juan? Goodness gracious! Having you guys together that tr tricks me out every time. So, uh, do, uh, 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 you can call me. Uh, you can um, call me by my second name. What's your second name? Is that on here? Uh, no, but but I can tell you so so you can make the. All decision. right. Sure. Yes. What's your second name? Jose. Jose, okay, there it is, nice and easy. Okay. All right, so Jose, um, do you do you have a stressful lifestyle? Is your life stressful? Uh, yes, it is. Okay, okay, and why why is it stressful? Why is your life so stressful? Uh, because well, I, I work with uh, computers, and um, uh, I have uh, different type of clients and bosses that sometimes. And when a problem arrives, a technical problem, uh, they 
they want uh, it to be fixed no matter what and mm -hmm. in a time frame that sometimes is just uh, impossible not, yeah impossible it's, it's not the in actual in, in real life it, it ain't possible so um, the the main problem is dealing with with them and the, and the user that is having the issue and how to explain that um, even though it's not uh, his or her fault or mine, mm -hmm. uh, I, I need uh, or any technician would need a, a little bit more time to fix it. Sure. So it's uh, it's very difficult. Or also, there are sometimes issues with. Uh, some, sometimes, that, sometimes there are issues. Sometimes there are issues mm -hmm. where um, they can be fixed, or or if I if I tell you it was fixed, I I, I would be lying to you. Mm -hmm. So I I prefer to tell the truth to, to have some ethic there. Mm -hmm. But then the other person would say, no, 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 you you're just lazy. So I I won't give you any more job. So oh, I wow. get st I get stressed because of that because I think well, even though I'm not uh, doing that, I, I'm telling the truth. But that sure. would have, should I had lied because I get the stress because of future job and payment. So that's yeah. where, where it, get, it gets tricky. Sure. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you for your thank you for your answer. Let's go to John. <clears throat> All right, John, let's see here. Um, okay, John, do, do certain colors make you feel happier? Or do colors not really have any effect on, uh, on your day or how you're feeling? Uh, is ecology uh, t tell? Uh, okay. Is blue? Is green? In general, of colors, past okay. the, o, o claritos, no sé cómo sea claros. Uh, yeah, like uh, light, light colors, like light blue, um, things light? like that. Okay. Light. Uh, we, um, if it's a, a color that be claro, it would be, <clears throat> excuse me, it would be like light. We would say light blue, okay, light, light pink, light green. Okay, things like that. Mm -hmm. Yes, but but in general is is the the to be alone, I think, if slowly, the that, that my problems, and treat the that to make the thing of the good form. Okay, all right. So uh, so yeah, sometimes colors can uh, can affect you. They don't affect me uh, all that much. Uh, if you guys notice, I do wear a lot of brown, gray, black. Okay, I like solid colors. This, uh, this, what I'm wearing today is probably as crazy as I get, right? The um, is that is right and light green. Light, white and light green. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Let's go to Ismail. All right, Ismail. Let's go back up to the top here. And all right. Okay, so um, let's do these two questions right here. So how does stress affect you? And do you have a, a kind of red warning flag that in, indicates too much stress? Yes, I have uh, many warning flags when I have under stress chat. Uh, my blood pe pressure is increasing when I feel uh, stressed and I cannot uh, sleep well in the night and I, I I am starting to forget everything my uh, home key car key my uh, special products uh, really yes wow wow so yeah so you've got you've got a, a, a few different warnings that you're like oh too much stress I need to figure yeah. out how to how to get rid of some of this right Yes, uh, I understand uh, when I am under stress very lightly. Okay, very good. Yeah. Yep, sorry, I had to had to take a drink. Okay, yeah. very good. Thank you. 
Um, okay, let's go to Giovanni. And Giovanni, this will probably be our last question. I'm going to skip over helping others and go to healthy stress. Um, Giovanni, does stress make you feel more alive? Yes. Uh, stress makes me feel uh, more alive in a way because, uh, okay. okay, it's just, uh, uh, okay, every human being is affected by stress, I think. And uh, it's a way to distinguish what, uh, ourselves from animals, even though I think that even dogs and cats are, are stressed in a way. And uh, yes, I, I usually feel uh, more alive when I, when I am under stress. This is okay. my... Yes. But I think that... Okay, though, I... <laughs> I was I was thinking about that uh, that the main cause uh, the main the main reason of my stress besides my mother-in-law is the lack of sex. <laughs> okay, but uh, <laughs> I think that right. yeah, I think it's true. It, I think it's true because uh, sex is just a, a good remedy for everybody. There, there you go. It can it can be. Yeah. Uh, very fun. All right, you guys. Uh, excellent. Thank you for uh, for coming to class this hour. It was great having you here. I need to run over to my next class. Um, I will be uh, running a, a class where we'll be uh, talking about going to the movies, Okay, learning uh, vocabulary words, phrases, and things like that that we can use when we go to the movies. That's my, my next class right after this. Okay? All right, guys. Thanks for coming. Bye. Bye. See ya. Bye. 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 Bye.